Hello guys! So today we're gonna talk about TypeScript and not just today, I'm gonna actually start a series about TypeScript uh, so let's just start it! So the first thing, thing you need to know is about TypeScript is it's actually like a, like a baby a baby of two languages two very very important and uh, powerful and uh, famous languages JavaScript and c -sharp. TypeScript takes both the benefits of both of the languages and combines them together and mixes them up and uh, it's very 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 comfortable for both people who came from the JavaScript and from the c -sharp. From one side it takes the, all the benefits of JavaScript being flexible, being uh, quick and uh, doing lots of stuff very very fast and easy and uh, from the other side it takes the, the type safety of uh, c -sharp and with it you can work on large scale projects with lots of people and uh, communicating through types and uh, you can get uh, very 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 smart com uh, compilation errors and uh, lots of other other great stuff but basically people don't like about c -sharp is it's usually what I hear is it's very very hard to write simple things do things fast because there is all, all of stuff that you need to add around like interfaces, classes and uh, type safety and you need to specify the types of the parameters so in TypeScript you can, you can do that if it's comfortable for you, if you think it's important for this particular part but you don't have to, you can just write JavaScript and when you want you can add a few little bit of uh, types and other cool stuff if you get annoyed by types you can lose them simply, don't use them for libraries, external libraries that you take from the internet there is very very good intelligence that comes with the TypeScript and a few videos later I will probably show it to you uh, so let's just dive into the code so let's just start with uh, initializing the environment okay so Okay, okay, we need, okay, do do do, yeah, come on, come on, computer, do stuff, okay, yeah, sure, sure, yeah, why not, why not, why not, why not, why not, yeah, yes, okay, so, my package JSON is created, okay, I don't really need tests right now, so seems okay. Sure, okay. So after initially initializing my uh, npm, let's initialize the TypeScript environment. So it's very very simple. TSC in it. TSC by the way is the TypeScript compiler. You need to install it globally if you want to. It's a uh, npm install. Uh, minus g TypeScript. Okay, so it tells me successfully created a TS config file. Okay, so now I see it. So basically, what it says is uh, some uh, configuration for the TypeScript compiler. I will dive into that a little bit later. So let's assume it's, it does something important and uh, leave it like this. Okay, and uh, I'm on a repository, a master. So let's just commit it npm uh, commit sm initialize script uh, ok commit committing yeah sorry 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 forgot forgot to add files yeah yeah ok ok initialize committing Mm -hmm. What? I'm an idiot, okay? Git commit. Git commit. Sam initialize TypeScript. Now it should work. Okay. Too fast change. Okay, git push. To origin master, yeah. Do -do 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 -do. Okay, git status, and I should be okay. Yeah, I'm okay. Let's just start with a simple, simple hello world. Okay, so I'm just creating a file index.ts. TS is the TypeScript uh, file extension, like JS, just for TypeScript. Okay, so I'm just created a TS. I'm writing a function, say hello, 
that receives a name and logs um, hello with the name. Okay, and and I'm just gonna say hello. Okay, so the first thing that you notice here is uh, it tells me I have some kind of an error when I put my mouse in it. So it tells me supply parameters do not match any signature of call target. So this is what I meant by saying that JavaScript and TypeScript are very very similar, but it's not the same. Uh, so it actually helps me not to make a stupid mistake of uh, not passing a parameter uh, to the function because it knows that say hello should uh, should receive one parameter and uh, I'm not passing any. So let's just say uh, I'm gonna pass my name. Uh, okay, the first thing we need to do before we can run it because uh, let's just say we run it. Okay, actually let's just run it. Index yes. What happens? Okay, hello Slava. So basically TypeScript, you can see it's, it's okay, you can see. You can see now that TypeScript is actually JavaScript. You see it's nothing more or less that you've already seen. Um, okay, so it's it works just fine like this. Uh, so let's add a little bit more stuff to make it more TypeScript and more the type of the TypeScript, okay? More similar to C Sharp. We're gonna say that uh, name is actually gonna be a string, okay? It's actually gonna be a string. Uh, and now when we try to run it, it will probably fail. Yeah, it's failing because it says uh, 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 it doesn't know what are these dots in the middle of the function declaration. The next thing we're gonna do is uh, we're gonna transpile it to uh, JavaScript, okay? And the simplest way to do it right now is just run the tsc command. Uh, before I do that, I'm gonna show you the file explorer. Uh, I'm actually in this TypeScript playground uh, directory. And uh, when I'm gonna run it, you will see that it will add an index.js file, okay? And I'm just gonna show it to you. Open to the side, control. I'm just gonna show it to you that well what's wrong no yeah like this I hope you I hope you see it so basically it's the same function we uh, we've written before okay just in JavaScript so when I remove this type and I save and compile again you will see that basically it doesn't do anything Okay, this type. So it's mainly for the type trip environment. And if I just, for instance, uh, call this function with a number, okay, it now uh, gives me an error that uh, the 5 is not a string, so it can pass it. So let's just see if it compiles. I actually don't really know if it's gonna compile. No, it's not comp gonna compile. But let's say I'm gonna. And I'm gonna remove this to any. Now it should compile. Okay, I will explain later what is this any thingy. But for now, let's just make it a string. String. Okay, and compile. Okay. Okay, I'm just compiling. So for now, I'm gonna close this. We don't really need it. I prefer you to see the code. After compiling TypeScript to JavaScript, let's just make sure it's correct for now. Okay, so compiling, I, I can simply run the index.js, okay? And see the result, hello Slava. That's it. This is my repository, okay? It's like 57 at TypeScript Playground. You can see <coughs> this example here. Uh, I will uh, gradually add uh, some stuff and uh, the videos that I make will uh, be added to this repository. So if you are following me or just uh, uh, viewing the first time, you can uh, watch the, look at the repository and see the, the old examples that I do.
So what we've seen today, today we've seen the introduction to TypeScript, very very little of it, got a little taste of it, and how to set up the environment, what is TypeScript, and a simple simple example of how to write a TypeScript. In the next episodes I will show you much more stuff, and you should really watch them if you're into TypeScript, I just wanted to learn. And so next time, I'm Slava, and see you at uh, Program Artist. Bye!